I nearly got run down. I was a bit drunk from the party. I'd been crossing that road from the insurance building to the James Street station every day, week in, week out, for 30 years. I never got knocked down once. But I was a bit boozed up from the do. It was a good do. They had one of the directors down, pretending he knew me, gave me my gold watch. Smarmy bastard. He'd have sacked me in the 80s if I hadn't threatened to tell his wife that he was not my secretary. Bastard. Anyway, so I was on the train home, thinking that's the last time I'd make that journey home from work. Thinking of all the time that I'd be able to spend at home. Amanda's already got a big stack of holiday brochures lined up. Mediterranean cruise. She says we can spend so much more time together now. What a catastrophe that would be. I've been trying to think of all the hobbies I could do, just to keep away from her. I wasn't very good at pottery. I haven't got the thumbs for it somehow. And that uh, oil painting's not my bag either. I think I'll have to think of something less creative. I don't know why I thought I'd be able to go from uh, from insurance clerk to Michelangelo when one fell swoop anyway. But I'll have to think of something. Maybe gardening. Gardening. Mind you, all those sharp, heavy implements and Amanda there, morning, noon and night. <laughs>